Because that, that to me, is, that, be, that to me, when you say that to me, that's basically saying that you think I'm, I'm, my, my, my opinion is so dumb that, 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 you, that, you, you, that I think is right. I, that's basically what you're saying. That's the reason why I, you know, I, I don't, I don't like people like that. I stay away from people like that. If you just can't be like, I agree, disagree, and I keep it like that, then, then, don't, then leave me alone, you know? You can disagree. Honestly, yo. That's the point. You, that, you can disagree. Like me, okay, me and my boy Carl, we talk all the time, right? And he disagrees with certain shit I say, and, and I'm, I'm, I'm a intelligent, I'm a, I'm a intelligent black man, and I'm like, okay, let me know where your disagreement is. And he tells me. And some, sometimes... Sometimes I agree because he breaks it down. Sometimes I still disagree, and I bring up my point. But it, you know, it comes to the point like I think he's dumb, and he think, he think I'm dumb. No, they, they, they don't say they gonna say they gonna say you're dumb. They gonna say well, this is how they gonna they sugarcoat it by saying, "Oh, you think you're right." No, 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 I know, I know what you're saying. I know you saying. I'm talking. About, I'm just talking about an example. I'm just giving an example like of two intelligent people talking, like me and you. Yeah, but that's the point. That's the point. But some people don't think. People, people get to the point where. They think that your shit is so stupid that they don't think you are intelligent. Yes, and that's, that's yes, the type of people yes, I stay away right. from. Yes. I mean, I, per, per, I got, I got, I got people like that in my family. I got people like that. I got people like that all that I did. Same I, here. You know, you can't. You know, you have a different opinion and you disagree with what they saying. And they disagree with Jan. The first thing they say, oh, he think you right all the time. It's, no, it's basically, not, basically, basically, you, you basically saying when you say that, you basically you, you ain't disrespecting me. Because basically, you saying yeah, that you're, right. you're, you're a dumb motherfucker that think he's right. That's basically what you're yep, saying. Yep. I, to- I totally you know, agree with you. Instead of just saying, listen, we, I disagree. I never, never once in my life had a, had a debate with people and told them that, and told them, that, oh, you think you're right all the time, or, or, you, or, you, or, or you think, no, I never, I was like, listen, I, you, 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 I just don't agree with your, with your opinion, and that's it, and, and leave it at that. You know, we, we agree to disagree. Yes. You know what I mean? Because people won't have their own opinions, man. My, my, thing, my, my thing is this. I don't have a problem with people having their own opinions, as long as their opinions don't become... A reality for me you know what I'm saying that's when that's when I have a problem like for example you know if somebody tell me that I don't they don't agree with the fact that I I, 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 I like to wear uh, 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 um, let me see I like, I like to wear a gold chain right I'm just making that example mm-hmm. that's yeah. cool you don't know that I don't think men should wear gold chains or wear jewelry what? What? no I'm just what? saying no you see you I'm sorry I'm sorry, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. that's cool that, yo whatever dude but when you try to make it into a law to ban me from wearing that stuff, that's when I have a problem. And they do do that sometimes. They tell they tell the dude straight up, man, you gotta take this jewelry off. Like when you come to a certain area, you gotta take jewelry off. You gotta take the earrings off. Everything. Yes, they do. Yeah, I told totally them. That's the point when I get to the point where you you basically take your hat off. That's the take. Yeah. That's when you try. Yes. That's when you. Yes. That's, that's when you're trying to take your opinion and and you're taking your opinion about what you think how people should dress, and and using it to to force. Your, your 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 opinions on people. That's what I don't like. You know what I'm saying? And that's what people then and people try to do it all the time, try to dictate what people how people live and this and that. You know, if you don't like somebody because of what they what they do, that's that's you have every right to to not like them. You know what? You're but right. but but if you try to stop them from, from 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 living their life because you don't like what they do, then that's when you have a problem. It brings up. It brings and that's up. what racism is about. Racism is like yeah. that. You know what I'm saying? You don't have to like me if I'm as a black man. You don't have to. You think you you don't like me because I'm a black and all that stuff because I'm a free man and, I, and I'm not and, 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 as, as a slave and, to, and making you money as a slave. Hey, you can you can talk all that shit you want to, but the minute you try to bring down laws to try to stop me from getting a job or stop me from making money, that's when I have a problem with you. And that's what Jim Crow laws was, was about. That's what all those laws back in the days was about. It's about to try to make black people suffer for being free. You know what I'm saying? For being free people. Yeah, you know? You're right. Absolutely, you're absolutely right. You know? Because um, it's, it's a lot of things that's coming out now. Like, I like the, I like the way uh, life is going on right now because it's a lot of truth that's coming out. A lot of truth. Like, for some reason, 2015 has been a year for, like, exposure. Exposing. Exposing is truth. No, it is. It is. It is. It is. Um... I give you one example. Um, that 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 white girl that act, acting black, right? I'm not trying. I'm not trying. I'm not trying to focus on her. I'm just saying. I'm just saying. I thought no, honestly, I thought I thought she was sick. I thought she was like mentally confused. But I, I had to, I had to dig deeper, and she's going back. She's going back. She's going back. She's talking about the ancient ways. She's talking about. 
where it started in Africa. So she's she's no, actually she's kind of right. She's kind of right. Let's, 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 let's look at it. All life started in Africa, right? And the first people well, on this planet, it, well, it wasn't called well, Africa. It wasn't Africa. You're right. You're right. I'm but sorry. We, I'm sorry. We call it Africa now. You're right. All life started there. And basically, she's just saying like, "Yeah, I am black. I'm black." And they're like, "What's wrong with you?" But you see this picture. You're not black. She's like, "I am black." You gotta look at. You gotta look into the, the deep picture of what she's talking about. She's representing her ancestors. Yeah, but she's rep. No, she is. She no, is. I, I know. But here's she the is. thing. Here's the thing, though, Chris. Here's the thing, though, Chris. Right. You know why I don't? I really don't give a damn about the, about the thing about what yeah. happened. You, I'm, gonna tell, I'm gonna tell you why. Okay. Because we, as a black culture, we accepted light skinned people like that for years. Because we know that the one drop rule was in place. It was light skinned people in Africa in ancient days. Too. Yeah, but I'm, I'm talking about America. We we all we already know there was biracial kids all over the place, even way back in slavery because of the, because of the, because of the slave masters, um, and we took them in because of the fact there's a one drop rule. Uh-huh. So why is so why is people up in arms that she can fake? Being black, being black. She's not faking. No, I'm just. She, no, I'm she's, just. She's, I'm not. I'm not trying to defend her. But for the people that's listening, I'm not trying to defend her. I broke it down because honestly, no, I'm trying to say. I understand what you're saying. She had a psychological problem. No, I understand what you're saying. I realize she don't. I understand she, what you're saying. She probably knows the history. No, knows she knows. History. She knows history and everything. I'm just saying that. So okay. I'm just saying that. Take that out of the equation. I'm talking about what yeah. the, the here and now. This is the reason why I don't give a shit, because the fact is. That's what the one that rule had done. The one that rule had done that where a person that looked like that can be considered black. So therefore, why is everybody surprised that she got away with it? When we we when we uh, we allow the one that rule to, to, to dictate what we how, how how black how the black community in America should look like. But well, you know what you know, you know we got light skin, dark skin, brown skin because the fact is the one that rule. So therefore. You know, you know, the, the main we accept we, we we was quick to accept her because because of the fact that we know about the, this one drop rule. So why is everybody shocked that she was able to play it off? The main, the main, okay, I'm saying right now, the you main, know, the main person that I think that people should uh, 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 gravitate to about that situation is Paul Moody. They, they should, they should ask him. They should have him a scene about the, the yeah. N word shit. They should ask him about this shit. And I bet you he will say like, "Well, you know, we all came from Africa." I, that's <laughs> not, but see, that's not, not, the, not, the, not the word Africa. We all came from that land. Yeah, but we. So, but I told you to take out the equation. Take out the equation. Take okay. that out the equation. I'm not. We know about that. We know that we all came. That all like civilization came from so there. Going back to that. No, but my thing is take it out of the equation. We're not talking about it. We're talking about here now about why she was able to get away with being black as okay. far as black American. Another okay, another thing. Take out. Think all about right, that. All right. we, we, you you broke it down, but but you forgot what you broke down. Mm-hmm. All you said was labels. Those are all labels. I know that. Those are labels. That's why I said the it. labels are fucked up. I know, and that's why that's why I said that. She, Those are all labels. And that's bro. why I said that. What I said because the fact is, because of one drop rule, which allow a lot of people that look like her to be in the black community. I'm not saying she shouldn't be. Because the fact is, if she does, if she did have like you know, what was a black father or a white, a black she mother. She kind of do look. She kind of like like in the, in the old picture. Come on, the old picture. Not, yeah. Not the new one. The old picture when she had the straight hair, her nose is fucking wide. Her lips is big. Okay, but that's so my. She, it's, it's, it looks like she does have some kind of. Oh well, well, well. Actually, she does. Well, I don't know because I saw I saw a, re- a regular picture of her. She like a straight old white chick. So let's let's, let's let, okay just shut everybody the fuck up. My Let thing, her take a DNA test. I know, but my thing is this: like I said before, we have been um, have been conditioned. Slaves, no, we've been. Slaves, no, I, I understand slaves, that. Slaves, listen, bro. this is what I'm trying to tell you. This is what I'm trying to tell you. We've been conditioned to take anybody of any color into the black community because of the one drop rule. So what I'm trying to say is, why is everybody shocked that she was able to get away with lying about her being black American? Oh. Why you. is everybody shocked? I oh, I can't believe she lied. How you? How? Why you? Why are you so shocked? I can't believe what? You know, there's a lot of fucking black people that look like her in our fucking communities. You know that? Yeah, yeah, yes, 
They do. So why are you shocked? That's my. That's what I was trying to get. I, I was like confused about like why y'all shocked? Why y'all shocked? And we didn't have these type of shades of, of blackness in our community. Then I understand. Because you got people like. But, but yeah, you got people like. I'm gonna bring. I ain't gonna say. I mean, I, look, I she was. No, let me tell you something. Let me tell you something. The way she looked at that lady looked at. She looked. She looked. At, she looked at Doctor and Raymond Simone. Yes, she did. Yes, um, she did. Yes, she did. And we consider Raymond Simone black, right? When she is, but we said her black. She's well high yellow. So why is everybody shocked that she that this lady was able to get away with it? Because, ladies and gentlemen, <laughs> boys and girls, we are all one. You dumb fucks. Of course we are. We know that. We yeah, know that. Dumb. No, we all one. No. They, like I said, I hate the fucking labels. I hate. I do too. Let's put it like this: It's not about pro-black. It's not about pro-white. It's not about pro-Hispanic. I've been it's saying that. It's about pro-human. You stupid fucks. I know that. I've been saying that. Human. But yo, I've human. been. But yo, but Chris, I've been saying that on the show for a long time. You I, have. You have. I've been saying yes, that. I said. Did. I said. If you, I said the problem with the with the world is that we got too much. We got too much racism, classism, tribalism. Uh, yes. or, or culturalism, uh, or sexism, you know, uh, and, and, and sometimes even religions that that that, that, that separate everybody from uh, separate of uh, uh, the whole world. You know what's gonna happen? You know what's gonna happen? You know, you know what's gonna bring us all together? Another species. I'm telling you. We had. We, uh, no, no, it's gonna happen. Species of what? Of. Okay, I just watched a commercial just now, right? Or AMC that's coming out. I'm not trying to promote y'all. Don't don't fucking promote this shit. It's called human vents, artificial intelligence. Okay. No, no, no. Seriously, seriously, it's uh-huh. happening. Okay. They create artificial intelligence with microchips, with robots. I know. I seen it. I seen some of the robots. And what's gonna happen? I seen is, a fucking robot dog, man. That, that thing was look like it was. It was really. It was, it, was, it was. Yeah. And guess. And guess what? That's gonna be our death. That's gonna be the death of the human race. Even no, it is. I, no, I, I said I didn't say I disagree with you. I said, well, that's yeah, what it, yeah, what it is. Y'all remember the Terminator movie? Terminator, Terminator. That was uh, created by uh, 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 Sophia Stewart. She predicted that shit. It's happening now. They creating artificial humans, and guess what? The artificial humans, or artificial intelligence, is going to see us as a threat. And guess what? That's when we all going to get together and come, come come to combat them let's do this shit before that shit happens because it's happening it's happening it's happening i ain't talking about cyborgs i ain't talking about people with uh mechanical arms i'm talking about artificial intelligence they have no soul let's keep it real this is the real shit real vision radio they have no soul so they're gonna see us as a threat and they're gonna eliminate us well, I'm tell- no, I'm well, like I said, well, listen, I'm not disagreeing with you. I'm saying, well, it is what I'm it is, you, Mr. Brett. I'm telling you, man. But this is my point here. You know, that's we, a no-no. That's I know, a no-no. I know, I know. But the thing is, is that it should be, you know, all humans should come together. But guess what? We live in a society. We're human. We're I know. But I, I know. That's my point. We, but unfortunately, we live in, this, in the real world. In the real world, we got society like America, where it go by race. And class. You know why they and think gender. that? You know why they think that? Because they thinking on some animal shit. Like, what about the wolves and the lions? That, that, the I know. That's I know. a totally different. That's a totally different situation. It, well, it's not really just a situation because we we all even even we we closer to them too. But anyway, we, are, we no, we are in some ways. But like, it's it's different though. It's different. But it's, my it's my different. thing, my thing is this, man. Like, I'm talking about the black, black, black people. Yes. I'm I'm saying this, and I'm saying this one time, and I'm saying this one time only. We're never going to get with racism if you keep on trying to to, 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 to to separate yourselves by culture. You're never going to do it. All right? We already got black Americans already in this country who don't like each other because they're in different gangs or whatever. We don't need other groups of blacks coming over to this country and all may try to separate themselves from the black Americans over here saying, I am not like y'all motherfuckers. I'm Jamaican or I'm Dominican or I'm I'm from Nigeria and Africa. Listen, man, that shit is not gonna it's not gonna do nothing to help the cause of fighting racism. It's not. That's the